Well, welcome my genies. We're back with the Sims for Devil's Darling and today is school. Pretty much it's Monday. And what's going to happen today? I don't know. If you haven't seen the last episode, Devil went through a, some kind of phase. Well, not some kind of phase, but a specific phase. Where she thought she had to change herself to impress Sydney, but Sydney loves her the way she is. And as you can tell from his expression, if you've seen it, then you'll know. Because he was like, eh, to her makeover. But she did keep the hair because it's really cute. And I'm not sure when Angel and Travis are going to graduate. I guess we'll find out. And the stupid bug. I swear there's nothing removed. I have all packs, thank you very much. Well, well, by the time this video comes, no, well, actually it would be Thursday. Yeah. What? Oh yeah, the, the kits come out on Thursday. I don't have the money to get them yet, but I will get them. And two, I'm not updating the game, the dang game, until that dang face bug is fixed. I'm not dealing my Sims with weird glitches. No, thank you. <laughs> I don't want Travis or Angel or <clears throat> any of my Sims or my mom's Sims or my sister's Sims to deal with the weird bug. Also, I hope the create a Sim bug gets fixed one day where you have the extra traits and it messes with your Sim. Basically corrupts them in a way. Yeah. And also, I hope the alien face bug's fixed too. I love the alien sims. I think they deserve to be properly fixed. Cause I don't. Cause also, second of all, I'm I'm playing with aliens and I'm not so very challenged. And Angel's been playing with aliens too. Well, the yeah. well, actually, my not so very Clem has an alien baby, and this alien baby's gonna be dealing with the, the face changing. Yeah. As he ages up. So. Right, Stu. I know the young adult uh, to adult, I think elder was fixed, but below that, no. <coughs> it would be really nice to see these bugs getting fixed. So, what's going on in the Cassandra Goth world? Ned and good. She's talking to Ash, so maybe Cassandra calmed her butt down since having a kid. I don't know. I think I, I think Ash and Cassandra are friends now. I don't know. Gemma's stuck in the locker. I think that's Minerva's daughter. I wonder if she sounds like Minerva. I don't know, but she had her at a very late age, didn't she? What in the world? Oh. Tiffany starting crap again? Really, Tiffany? I thought you were done with this. I thought you were going to leave everyone alone. Are you, are you mad at everyone? You keep yelling. Dang. You keep yelling at Travis and Ferris. Well, you're the one that didn't want to be friends with everyone anymore. That's your fault. So now you're mad because they're not talking to you? The way you... Ugh. I can't even talk now. Anyway, what I was trying to say was... Uh-oh. You're mad... She's pissed. Because they're respecting your wishes? Yeah, Ferris, I think, has to fight her or something. Look at her. She's mad. Hair sitting behind her. Maybe she'll put gum in her hair or something. I don't know. Or maybe she won't sit for a while. Anyway, I don't see Sydney ever come back to school again. She probably won't. Maybe graduated. Maybe? I don't know. I know since Sydney left, I noticed Ash has been here. And I, I don't know. Maybe they're a freshman or something. I don't know.
Oh, he doesn't have third trimester now. It showed that her and Travis can take family leave. I mean, I don't, I don't know how that would work with. I don't think that would work with your after school activity. And I don't see how Ada could really do cheerleading while being pregnant. Again. They could quit. Yeah, I was actually thinking about having them quit. Honestly, it's tedious. I, I was hoping that you could go with them and do stuff, but you can't. Now we're gonna have both of them quit. They're just not interested in that kind of stuff anymore. Well, they have a family. So, after math class, they're gonna quit their thing. Oh, Travis is already doing it. It's cold outside, and Angel didn't even bother putting on her cold weather. Yes. I think Angel was hungry before, but she didn't get to finish eating. She wants to chat with Ferris. And he wants to express his devotion to Angel. I swear, you better not start crap again, Tiffany. Ash was whining about something. Maybe they're maybe they're whining about Cassandra. I don't know. I don't know if Angel could fight when she's pregnant or not. I kind of doubt it. Oh, Ferris is still mad. Yeah, she has a temper. She has a big mess with her. Just telling Come Ferris on. about me, Cleaver. Okay. Anyway, what I was about to say was Angel is asking if Ferris why in the world is Tiffany still bothering them. And Ferris is upset. She doesn't want to talk about Tiffany. So that's kind of why she was a little bit upset with Angel over that. Who is the principal talking to? The author? I don't know. I think the principal's. I don't know. Someone the principal. Fucking yes. like Walker. Is someone in there? <clears throat> Maybe somebody got locked in there. She has to get him out. Oh, is she talking to the teacher? The teacher's all the way over there. Why are you talking? Never mind. I'm not gonna question. Ferris is feeling embarrassed now. Maybe she, I'm, I'm guessing she feels embarrassed because how she reacted. <coughs> anyway, back to fighting. Angel's dating someone. She does not have a crush on Ferris. She's in a committed relationship, so she wouldn't crush on somebody else. <coughs> she did have a crush on Ferris. Yeah, I was fighting Tiffany. Yes. Yes. I don't think Angel can. <laughs> Good job 
Yeah, Angel can't fight her. Because she's pregnant. I thought the fighting before was basically get through Tiffany's head to leave everybody alone. They don't say anything to her, it's just her starting drama. Okay, now they're in... Actually, I have no idea. They wait for to come up. Science class? I've always loved science. I think my favorite thing to learn in science, in my opinion, was about weather and the solar system. Those are my two favorite things to learn about. <coughs> Very interesting. And I can never memorize the periodic table for nothing. I did. I learned it in school. I have a terrible memory. So that's probably why I didn't do as well in school, because I can never focus at all. And I don't know why. I can never pick up anything. Okay, listen to the teacher's instructions. Okay, maybe it was because Travis wasn't really paying attention, but for some reason he realized that a bowling ball was flying at his face about 0 0.2 seconds before it bounced off his forehead. Thankfully it wasn't very fast, but it still hurt. Dude. Travis got injured by a bowling ball. Wow. He took a bowling ball to the face. Honestly, if a bowling ball did hit you, it'd probably break something. Or it'd probably knock you out, depending on where it hit. He looks fine to me. Yeah, he's fine. I guess he wasn't paying attention, really. He's feeling very confident, though. Yeah, that's why. Or maybe the whole thing about Tiffany got him distracted, too, because she keeps bothering everyone. Oh, Candy's an A. That's good. Well, since we're at school still, maybe she wants to go home. I don't know. Why not go and sit for the exam at school? For a little bit. I mean, it is Monday, so they haven't studied yet. And Candy, ha not Candy, I mean Devlin, my gosh. Devlin has to go to, <coughs> excuse me, test soon. Why don't you have to go? Oh, this is now. Where she have to go? <clears throat> Devlin has to go to chess practice. Oh. Is that what it said? Yeah. No, chess team. I'm sorry, not chess practice. I don't know what I'm thinking. I swear, if Tiffany showed up at the house, I don't know what, I don't know what to do if that happened. I think we're pretty much almost done with studying, too. Oh, it's chess team. Okay. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. And I and since Angel is in her this reach her third trimester today, I don't think she's going to give birth in this episode. I mean, I know early labor is a possibility, but I don't think I've experienced it in my own gameplay due to the realistic childbirth mod, so I don't know. I don't, I don't, when I, when I recorded Country Life, Ugh. I didn't have the real estate childbirth mod then. I don't know if it was out Ugh. then or not. But Kanika had an early labor on her own. As soon as she had the third trimester, she was in labor. I remember mm -hmm. that. <clears throat> she was. Alright, I think they're done with, set, built, done with studying, so they're going to head home. You know, made it home before Travis did. <clears throat> That's kind of funny. 
Because Travis is running and Angel is just walking. Unless you had a setting before him. I think that's what happened. What happened? Uh -huh. Oh, bills. No wonder. $5,097. <laughs> Oh, Devlin's back from chess team. I keep wanting to say chess practice. Uh, so I think Devlin has to study too. Oh, Angel's grilling. Where's Travis's homework? Oh, it's over here. I was concerned for a second. I want to think Jesse and James had their first day of elementary school. I wonder how they felt about it. They're feeling fine, so I'm guessing it went. I'm, I'm guessing it went good. Real fruit. Angel's really working hard, hard on her cooking skill. She seems to enjoy it a lot. No, I'm not messing with that because that's still a bug. And Angel went ahead and got Frank's and beans instead. Craving, maybe. Maybe. At first she wanted grilled fruit, but then she changed her mind and wanted Frank's and beans. You can fart oh, it's on, I'm sorry, that's camper stew. What? What happened? Wait, Jack's dead? What? Jack died. How? I don't know. How did he die? Um, how and when? Um, I'm back. I'm going to. What in the world? That's ridiculous. How did he die? Doesn't say. That's so weird. Well, he's alive now. It's really sad because. Because Cassie and Jack were getting along so well, no son, he's dead. Where's Joshua did it? Maybe he did. <gasps> oh no. But don't worry, Jack's back alive. Jack's a pirate, so he got um some kind of reviving thing that he found in his treasure chest. Yeah, yeah that yeah, that's what happened. That, that's how he became alive again. He has a bunch of those. He's prepared in case anything happens. Or maybe Candy did it. Not, can, not Candy, but Candy Bear. Joshua's flame. Woman. I don't know. Drama. I mean, only had two dates. I know. But don't worry, Jack's fine. Why didn't it show him that he died? They know each other. Wouldn't somebody call? I would hope so, but I guess not. Maybe it's a glitch. Maybe. Eee, that's gonna be rotten soon. Well, apparently the sink didn't want it either. It threw up. I was trying to get rid of a few things. <clears throat> okay, that's not enough for everybody. Okay, I think everything, everything else is fine. And she's hysterical. We don't want her dying.
I'm not sure what station that is. Um, for real? I don't know, it looks pretty though. I'm probably butchering that, I'm sorry, but. I don't know. How long is Farrah staying? Okay, she's, I think she's leaving Tuesday. Oh, Candy's gonna be aging up soon. Oh, uh, Travis is gonna go ahead and get something to eat, I think. He wanted a cookie! Not a meal, boy. Are you getting it for Angel? No. I have no words for you, Travis. Angel's gone through the distant phase? I wonder why. I think this pregnancy is causing her a lot of emotions. I see. He's very tense. Maybe try to... Maybe try to calm down the mirror. Beautiful. See the name of her homework? Uh, she couldn't continue it because she was too tense. Yeah. You should have really listened to music and not focusing on your homework. Okay, Jessica got done with her homework. And James did too. <coughs> Candy's already an A student. <laughs> Jesse's not really that hungry anyway. Uh -huh. Jesse's not really that hungry. Yeah. I don't know about James. No, he's not either. I guess they're, they're both going to go ahead and head to bed. No one likes me, no one will ever like me. Why bother with anything anymore? <clears throat> Everyone loves you, Travis. You're always so nice. Anyway, you're still hungry, so go ahead and eat something besides a cookie. Oh, he's eating Angel's Grilled Fruit. Angel's being stubborn and doing her homework, apparently. I'm I'm glad Jack is back al alive. Me too. Cause that was unexpected. They knew Joshua. What did you and Candy Bear plan? I guess Candy wanted to listen to music upstairs. Angel's playing with her book. Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're sitting next to each other working on their homework.
Alright, she's done with her homework. That's good. <coughs> Well, since they're working on their homework and stuff, I'm going to go and end this episode here. I'm trying to... I know my 7 Infant Challenge and Hunter Bay Challenge were really long episodes. But I'm going to try to make them shorter due to the internet not being so great recently. Yeah. So. <coughs> Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you hit the notification bell to get notified when I upload. Tiffany. I love you all so much. Bye. And Tiffany's calls me a lot of drama. Bye, everybody. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> oh, bye, everybody. Goodbye, everyone. It's Ed and the Ed Lions. Hi, what's on the one of yours? It's Kevin Arnold. Thanks for telling me, Fred. You're welcome. Goodbye. Goodbye, it's Edgar. Tiffany's a bitch.